bag of holding potatoes. Item number, SCP-1689. Object class, safe. Special containment procedures. SCP-1689 is currently under restricted access in area blank, medium size artifact storage, compartment blank. SCP-1689 is to be stored, tied shut with its mouth facing upwards, at all times. Access is limited to level 3 personnel, with the exception of site cooking staff. Exploratory access to SCP-1689-A requires approval from a level 4 personnel. All expeditions must be documented, with a complete manifest of equipment and staff to enter. Enzymatic Compound 13 has been developed to aid in exploration of SCP-1689-A. Proposals to establish a mobile site in SCP-1689-A are currently under review. Description SCP-1689 is a burlap bag of potatoes. In its stable state, SCP-1689 weighs 40 to 50 kilograms and contains approximately 200 common agricultural potatoes. Tubers of Solanum tuberosum. SCP-1689 is made of brown, roughly woven jute. The interior of SCP-1689 is vastly larger than its exterior and is designated SCP-1689-A. SCP-1689-A is a large, extra-dimensional space of undetermined volume, measured to be at least 10,000 meters cubed, but believed to be much greater, completely filled with potatoes. Exploration of SCP-1689-A is largely incomplete due to the high degree of obstruction. For more information, please see Addendum 2, Exploration Log 1689-I. When portions of SCP-1689-A are empty, nearby potatoes experience an abnormal form of growth characterized by tumor-like bulges emerging and eventually splitting into fully-sized, independent potatoes. The rate of growth is roughly exponential, with a doubling period of approximately two hours. This effect also applies to normal potatoes introduced to SCP-1689, as well as similar edible tubers, or roots, such as yams and sweet potatoes, although none have been found to occur within SCP-1689 naturally. Addendum 1689-1 SCP-1689 was recovered from Kosovo, a small village of approximately 200 people in northern Siberia. A Russian official reported on the 2nd of June, 2000 and blank, that Kosovo had made no outside contact in four decades and had no surrounding farmland. The reports were confiscated and investigated by the Foundation, at which point it was discovered that the village had been using SCP-1689 as its sole food source for well over a century. No one in the village was able to recall how they had come into possession of SCP-1689, only that it had been there since before the Reds, and that it was a gift for working hard. SCP-1689 was subsequently transported to Area Blank, its current location. Addendum 1689-2 Currently, only one fully equipped expedition into SCP-1689-A has taken place. Authorized personnel may view the mission log of Captain Cameron Wells. Exploration Log 1689-1 